a very good morning students so for today's learning our topic is article lighting in section b as we discussed yesterday uh, that uh, speech writing and during that time i told you to discuss article lighting for today's topic so first of all we should know what is an article basically article is a long uh, piece of writing that involves a high degree of creativity it actually involves a high degree of creativity a wide vocabulary a strong kind of word bank uh, through knowledge of the subject and a lot of organization abilities it means actually this article writing basically a long piece of uh, writing that involves a high degree of creativity a good kind of word bank and thorough knowledge and a great skill of organizational abilities it means it involves such things like creativity knowledge of the uh, subject and to sequence the <clears throat> things in proper order that is called uh, article writing now the format first of all what should we need to take care title the very first thing comes under title and the title should be catchy sharp in understanding and meaningful that at least to be very catchy sharp and meaningful then after that this is called byline in which the writer writes his name okay name of the author or writer okay dear students the first two things are here that title and byline now the real body of the article get started now in which first thing is for in actually we need to write three paragraphs first paragraph goes for introduction of title it means whatever the title itself suggests it should be written in the very first paragraph and what is the purpose of the title and approximately 50 words or more than 50 words you can write in first paragraph that is very mandatory to introduce your title in the very beginning of the article then second paragraph <clears throat> contains cause and effect so what are the uh, you can say negative as well as positive points of the concerned title on which the title is being written and with examples as i told you yesterday also in speech writing the example should be well known to the public it should not be known to any one particular person okay so here cause and effect what are the causes and effects of this particular title you need to write in paragraph number two now third one third paragraph actually goes for conclusion basically but it also provides some solutions okay so in second paragraph approximately 75 words and third paragraph approximately 25 words it is approx it becomes approx 150 okay if you cross then 30 like or 80 so it crosses 150 because its word limit is 150 to 200 so approximately 180 you covers okay so here in this one main, main things are quotations if you start your article with a quotation and ends with a quotation it gives a very good kind of impression to the examiner so dear students try to write your article at least by providing one quotation either in the beginning or by the end of the article now word limit as i told you 150 to 200 now some certain things you need to take care first these pronouns okay i my me then according to me this particular phrase according to me then according to us this one then as we know as you know i suggest you dear students try to avoid these things because as far as personal pronoun is concerned we never use in this article writing so these are the four things you need to take care 
I, my, me means for a personal pronoun, according to me, according to us, as we know or as you know. Try to avoid these phrases and personal pronoun. Now, next step is marking scheme. Total marks is 10. Got it? Then division is 1 plus 5 plus 4. Total 10. So, 1 goes for format. In format, what do we include? Title and byline. Okay. This is called byline. So, these two things, they give you one mark. Next one is content. In this content, division is total total marks are 5 and division is 2 and half, 2 and half. 2 and half for coherence and subjectivity. What kind of sequence signs of the examples or the content you provide in the content that goes for 2 and half and subjectivity 2 and half. And in this part, content the main thing is use of idiomatic language is most important part you should use some kind of uh, idioms to provide your point then next four marks are expression in expression division is two and two two marks for fluency and two marks for accuracy fluency requires your flow in your language and accuracy require your grammatical errors spelling errors overwriting etc so this is the division of 10 marks 1 plus 5 plus 4 total 10 now one example i have written for you people value education the need of the r okay this is the title and this is called byline so title is value education the need of the r and this is byline so one mark is covered in these two parts this is one mark now as i told you if you start your article with quotation it gives you a good kind of expression to the examiner so first quotation is education without values as useful as it is seems rather to make man a more clever devil this is called devil so very good kind of quotation this is i repeat education without values as usual as it is seems rather to make men a more clever devil it means a value uh, sorry uh, an education without values make a man not a man but a clever devil understood now the modern competitive time of today has made value education quite significant in this competitive era having divided into two categories two categories we have of education like formal and informal what are the formal type that we get in uh, institutions and informal that we get at our at our homes like in our surrounding or in our society no educational institution have methods to uplift the students morally see morally spiritually and physically so three points have been pointed out now the whole emphasis is on academics the more emphasis or the whole emphasis is laid on academics rather than moral spiritual and physical spiritual and moral etiquettes find no place it means spiritual and moral morality find no place in our curriculum curriculum means the framework which is given by the ncrt then in addition to the above side see the i have used this kind of uh, above in, in addition to the above sad compound words i use here this is because the makers of destiny themselves are losing the vigor to be a role model of morality they are surrounded by the flatterers rather than doing any tangible work for the nation building during this time they just grinned their own axes see grinned their own axes medium and selfish motives the politicians professors and leaders 
see the example the politician professors and leaders have <clears throat> have forgotten their duty of making the generation sound in all aspects okay so these three people like politician leaders and professors now illegal means have become common to get the things done illegal means corruption illegal means to get the things done then how can we raise the moral of the students now here this is a question tag how can we raise the moral of the of the students the sharp decline in moral standards all around due to the Klaus attitude of common man's interest in increasing hypocrisy and double talk which have led to deterioration deterioration which in truly alarming which is truly alarming the worst form of human exploitation the collection of wealth by any possible means are the order of the day moral ethical values performance of duty regard and consideration for fellow men sympathy and compassion are things which have gone with the wind which have gone with the wind see the expression then however a closer look clearly tells us that degeneration has started from the roots and society is fast declining our great leaders like gandhi subhash chandra bose dr radhakrishnan have all spoken for the see crisis of character and this this quotation i have given in the uh, inverted commas crisis of character means character depend on education and uh, sorry ha huh, uh, this one character depend on education and education depend on values if you do not have values then your character will be lost anyhow now ending part with a quotation education is the passport to the future for tomorrow belongs to those who prepare for it today see i have written this one with the quotation 1 2 3 4 here in the beginning 4 at least four best kind of expression i have mentioned in the article writing so that's all for today dear students and uh, as i get share this link to you in the whatsapp group i'll give you some kind of exercise to be sold at your home thank you dear students have a good day